Welcome everyone to the Military Bowl presented by Northrop Grumman as part of Capital One Bowl Mania today with the Cincinnati Bearcats and the Virginia Tech Hokies about to do battle here from Navy Marine Corps Stadium in Annapolis as we welcome you to this final day of calendar year 2018. Happy early new year everyone. Mike Corey, Rudy and Goya and Alex Cordry on the sidelines in a moment. Let's start with Virginia Tech, Rudy. Not the type of year they were used to having, but once again, they find themselves in the postseason. Yeah. Fourth and two with Peoples the deep back. It's a fake to him. Willis airs it out and he's got a man and it's Chris Cunningham. Well, they're changing up now as Charles McClellan's in the backfield on a third down for Cincinnati. Pressure comes and they dump it off on the screen and the Bearcats with McClellan. He's going to go into the end zone. Touchdown. It is third down and short for Virginia Tech coming back from the timeout. Willis hands it off and it's Trey Turner. Turner breaking free. Holston's in the backfield for the Hokies here on a second down and long. Ryan Willis airs it out up top. Now oh, the catch is made by Trey Turner. Second to four keeper here by Hayden Moore. At the middle he goes. Hayden Moore. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Hayden Moore and Ryan Willis want to credit the two quarterbacks for what they've done here in this one. Well, of course, Hayden Moore, you're coming off the bench, right? You're not thinking you're going to play in this one. Desmond Ritter goes down. He comes in, and he's played well. And Ryan Willis, I think, has stepped up and had an excellent game as well. So I agree with that. And here comes Ryan Moore. Or Hayden Moore, excuse me, can he lead Cincinnati to victory today? And the handoff, it's going to go to Michael Warren. Warren breaking free into Virginia Tech territory and finally brought down the 32. Well, we talked about holding him in check. Now a couple big runs for Warren. And he's officially no longer in check with his numbers. 31-yard run by Warren. Coming up on three minutes left in the contest. Warren gets inside the 30 yard line. And we remind you after the conclusion of today's game, the post game trophy ceremony presented by Capital One comes your way. Uh, the ESPN app immediately following the game today, so don't miss out on that. Post game trophy ceremony presented by Capital One. Warren limping a little bit there. It's been a long game for him, right? He's over 100 yards, well over 100 rushing, but some hard fought yards today. Second and seven. More. Again, powering his way down close to the 20 yard line. First down run for the quarterback. Yeah, he knows, right? Randy, it's his last game. Yeah. He's going to lay it all out. And the they've line. had success with that quarterback power. I like the patience. Hayden Moore shows, lets those linemen pull out in front of him. And he wants a walk off here. They don't want to kick a field goal tie this thing. They want to score. They want to run this clock down to the end. And if you're Virginia Tech, you only got two timeouts left. But if you're Justin Fuente, you got to start thinking about taking one. The rain has finally stopped a little bit here now in Annapolis, Maryland. This is Warren spinning his way inside the 10-yard line. It's going to set up a first and goal for Cincinnati. So the clock will stop on the first down. It'll set and rerun. And now if you're Virginia Tech and Justin Fuente, you got to get a stop here. And then you burn one of your timeouts because you got to try to save yourself some time if Cincinnati scores and takes the lead here. Right. Otherwise, you see Cincinnati, they got the brakes now. You got a senior quarterback in Havenmore. Just take in your time. Let the play clock run. First and goal, 10 by three, Cincinnati. Warren. Here he goes. Michael Warren stretches. Goal line. Touchdown. Bearcats back in front. 